your money with every round. That is a humdinger from Graham Dot. That was a bit going there. Remember, he beat me actually. Of course, he is a world champion. He has his name etched on the most famous snooker trophy of them all. Any particular clearance? I think it was the penultimate frame of the match, which was quite sensational. Cool dot. Full record. A finalist on two other occasions, losing to. Host. That's good. He's looking and uh, fiercely competitive. You want to pop these with blacks if he can. This is when I like to. Yeah, I guess the flip about running down that clock. Yeah, I just pause before I come to the table to play the shot, so I'll keep the rhythm the same, but I'll just take a little bit longer. here. Why right, could he roll the red in? That was a very, very tough shot. <laughs> Taking this tournament lightly, he's here to win this event. Went for the pot, but the reds very inviting. Tremendous pot. Yes. Red to try and knock the pink on, maybe into the centre pocket. Just jawed it, caught the near jaw. Yeah. Chance to potentially seal the match, but he's going to have to settle for the safety. He's still very. to come back into this match. Again with another good red. And that is another very clean pot. This is another missable one. Excellent pot again. Just a little bit concerned now. That's right, because you know it's a helpless, you can't do anything about it. 12. He knows not to panic, but the pressure perfect cue action and technique to really hold up under pressure when everything else. Bingham told us earlier here in the commentary box that you can miss absolutely anything. The yellow pocket, and surely. A place in the round of 30. He dodged a bit of a bullet there. Chow Gadong missing. Sure. 